So who am I speaking with? Hi, my name is Kevin Sistrom, the CEO of Instagram. Hey, Kevin, uh, great presentation up there with Ohm. Uh, I want you to go through some of the things you were talking about, about the difficulties of making a mobile app versus a web application, or a website, actually, for that matter. What, what are the specific difficulties? Well, you know, I really think that, you know, HTML and JavaScript are something that we all are very accustomed to. And when you get into Objective-C and you get into these native platforms, not only are you dealing with a different language, but you're also dealing with very different access patterns, right? No longer are you dealing with browsers and browser incompatibility, sorry. Um, but you're also dealing with, um, you know, things like being on 3G or Edge, right, that are really slow. So you have to make sure to optimize your app um, for speed and, and for, you know, inactivity of network. You created an application, and I must say, very brave of you to create an application that was in such an amazingly crowded space. Why do you think you guys came out on top? And really, I mean, people talk about your application with true love. What do you, what do you think uh, happened there? What were the different elements that you uh, put into it that make it so popular? I think um, it's actually what elements we didn't put into it. We kept it really simple. And um, the one thing that people keep saying on Twitter about Instagram is how addicted they are. Um, and that's what really excites us because we feel like we've created something that's easy to use and it's simple, right? I think the thing that makes us stand apart is that we removed extraneous features, right? And, and focused on what matters. And so go through the specifics. Sure, so we focused on speed of upload, right? A lot of people don't consider that a feature, but it's very much a feature internally. And we you know, graph it constantly and we, we make sure that it's always fast. The filters we put a lot of effort into, and with this V2.0 release, if you haven't downloaded it yet, you know, makes filters go from four second render times to four millisecond render times, right? And that's a huge jump in speed for us. So we're really excited about those small things that we concentrate on to make the user experience that much better. Specifically the filters. I have seen so many applications that allow for filters and most people completely ignore them. But I swear, I don't think anybody sends out an Instagram without a filter. Why do you think people love them so much? So two things. One is about a third of our photos don't have a filter, which is really interesting. Though they may use a filter in another application and simply not you know, filter it internally. I think that people use our filters because one, we put a lot of effort into making them good, right? I think there's you know, a subjective quality to our, our judgment about the filters. I think we're really excited about how hard we've worked on that. Secondly is we put it as part of the flow. It's not an extra option. It's simply presented you to you in the upload process. And I think that's what you know, makes a lot of people try it out initially and use it. And then very lastly, you were actually giving some advice to other developers. A lot of people who read Dice are, are developers in their own right. What advice would you give to people who are developing mobile apps and try to be as successful as you? Uh, move quickly and get the details right. Um, you know, putting out half-baked uh, apps is, I think, you know, the worst thing you can do. I think on the web, people are typically a little more lenient because it is easy to iterate. Um, do fewer things, but do the fewer things better. Uh, focus on the details of what matters in those few things, and I think you'll succeed. All right, so just very lastly, so what would be examples of details that matter? I know you specified for yours, but for global issues on, on all apps. Right. Well, I mean, simply things like speed and error cases, right? Like if you can't connect to the network, you know, fail gracefully. Um, you know, making sure the translations are correct. These small little details that, you know, really frustrate people. It's amazing how many, you know, apps you can download off, off the App Store. Um, and if you have Edge, they, you know, stop working and they start crashing, right? Um, there are all sorts of little details that matter, and really it's up to the specific application. But what I would do is take a step back and list out the three things that really matter for your app um, and make sure every detail about those three things matters. For us, it was speed, distribution to other networks, and speed of upload, right? Those things mattered so much that we made sure we nailed them. And I think that if you read out your three things, um, you know, you can be very successful as well. Kevin, thanks so much for your time. Thanks so much. I appreciate it.